Welcome back to Button Down Gaming. My name is Jay, and I am playing with myself. <gasps> Speaking of playing with myself, practicing a little mental masturbation here, uh, getting back to my point of the argument I was making earlier. And again, I'm not trying to... Well, not again. I, I should probably express that I'm not trying to um, badmouth anybody. Uh, I'm just trying to express my exasperation to an experience that I had. Um, give me back my stuff. Is that really all the brooches I had? I should probably get more soul before I go in here. I got soul, but I'm not a soldier. So anyway, we're talking about... Okay, I cannot kill you. I don't think. Let me try. I cannot kill you. Alright. Yep, you're too fast for me. Is there somebody I can kill? Please? I need soul. Oh, am I getting soul from that? Oh no, I need to hit him at least once. Okay. Damn it. Fuck. There we go. Oh! It is actually racking up the hits. So I can just continue to do that. Um, can you come back now? What do I gotta do to make you come back? Uh, so, my point... Eventually, at one point, it became obvious that one of the participants in this argument was not was not having a good time, and it is it is on me to be able to recognize that and you know back off or something. But um, that is also very unlike me, if you know me, um, which is unfair, especially since at a certain point in this whole thing, I was like, nope, I'm done. I really don't want to be here right now. Um, it was kind of an un-okay situation for everyone, but, uh, I was really upset, because at a certain point, after they talked about, oh, cool, this'll help, after they talked about how affirmative action is racism and all racism hurts all races, and... Therefore, affirmative action is damaging to the races it purports to help. Uh, and then my argument in return is that I'm sorry, but it's a racial problem, and racial problems have racial solutions. Um, you can't just say, oh, we're equal now, and there's nothing impeding you, no matter what your race is. Um, but obviously that's wrong. But even if it were right, it doesn't mean that there's a history and a social context that doesn't apply anymore, uh, that doesn't get in the way of their progress. And you need to start casting people of color in these roles. No, you're not coming back? Damn it. Um, before they can get famous enough to where you can consider them worthy of these roles. So, like, you need to... There needs to be a first step. There needs to be an initial step where you hire people of color for these roles so they can get popular enough or they can get the opportunity to become popular enough to where yeah you don't need to worry about race anybody can play these roles and you don't need to worry about casting somebody of a particular race in order to uh, uh feel like you get a return on your investment like i'm sorry i can't cast an asian person it needs to be a popular white woman in order to recoup my losses on this investment so it, there is a commercial imperative to be racist and that's also why there's no ethical consumption under capitalism but we're not gonna get there <laughs> that's not my point um god what was my point oh um at a certain point it was obvious that they were not having fun and they kind of wanted the conversation to end and they kind of made the point that effectively yeah. I hope I can still make this point while I'm 
doing this. Damn it. Already off to a bad start. Oh. Damn it, I missed it. She's too skinny. Yeah. Oh, come on. Okay. Come on, that was cheap. Damn it. Oh, she slides a little bit. That's cheap. That's also cheap. Okay, am I not supposed to kill you or something? That's two times you give me a little rest mode. Okay, nope. Fuck you. Jesus. Okay, you are actually defeated. Oh, what do you have? Mothwing Cloak. Oh, this is the dash! Use a cloak to dash quickly along the ground or through the air. Does it take soul? It does not. Would it seek to break the seals? They cannot be undone. They must be undone. Let us sleep, little shadow. Return to your darkness. Allow us our peace. Oh, hi, bugs. Uh, I passed out. Oh, good. Okay, so it's not a double jump for height. But it will get me distance. Cool. Awesome. Awesome. What did I say? I said it was going to be a double jump or a dash. And I was really hoping it was not going to be a stronger weapon. I want that later. And I got it. It happened. This is this is a Metroidvania. Um, anyway, at one point, one participant in this argument made the comment that... Uh, effectively... Um, Entertainment, because by virtue of it being entertainment, it is not a serious topic, and therefore uh, doesn't... How am I going to phrase this right to properly represent what they were saying? Um, doesn't actually represent... A, uh, doesn't actu actually like require discussion about something as serious as race. Was there... Wasn't there a... No, there was not. Okay. Um, and also, by virtue of it being just entertainment, and again, there's that term, just entertainment, um, it doesn't have the power to affect change socially. And because I'm an idiot, because I'm an idiot, I thought we were in a place where hyperbole was safe. Uh, I asked if this person was insane, and I felt really bad about it after the fact because people were like, whoa. I'm like, wait a minute. Like, you guys don't think I think that this person is literally insane, do you? Like, of course I don't. So what is it that you're taking offense to? And I guess it's the tone of the argument or whatever, and it's like... <sighs> I'm sorry, I got really worked up because this person, Lake of Un. Huh. Okay, I'm not going to go any farther. We'll do this next time on Button Down Gaming. But I'll, I'll wrap up my point. 
Um, the idea that art and society are not interlinked is insanity to me. Not literal insanity, but it's incredible naivete. There's a word for the link between art and society, and that word is culture. And to say that our everyday lives don't have an impact on culture and that culture does not have an impact on our everyday lives, on our thoughts and our feelings, and that it doesn't have the power to affect change is absolute nonsense and absurdity. And I felt hyperbolic. It was deserving of hyperbole. I asked if she was insane for suggesting otherwise. And it kind of brought the whole thing to a screeching halt. Uh, and it was not... Um, productive on any side and we didn't end up getting anywhere nobody's mind was changed not like they were going to be but nobody's points were really truly made oh shit I didn't even know I had this ability oh fuck okay well I'll need to keep that in mind um, so the argument is an important one to have and the way you have that argument is also important um, and I failed in that respect but Hopefully I made some good points on this recording and for all three of you that may eventually see this, um, hopefully you agree. And if you don't agree, I'll put it out there right now. If you are racist, sexist, homophobic, uh, any of that stuff, if you're not inclusive, if you're not understanding of other people, if... You are not accepting of other people and their lives as long as they're not hurting anybody else. Then um, even if you were the last viewer on this channel, I would not want you here. I hope I can say the same thing for Micah. I think I can. Um, we may disagree on a lot of things politically, but we do agree on that. So I would rather the channel go down than have our only audience member, you know, the last person on earth uh, as far as this channel is concerned. I feel that way. We don't want you. Um, if you are inclusive, if you are understanding, if you are loving of other people, then please, we welcome you. Uh, and I guess that's my point. And now I'm just sitting here in the middle of nothing, wrapping this up. So um, we'll talk about something else next time on Button Down Gaming. So come on back. Uh, you can continue to watch me play with myself, but the mental masturbation is done, at least for now. So bite.